Capitalism shapes the Internet. Early champions of the Internet saw it as a force for freedom that governments could not restrain. Their idea was that the free, fast flood of data would overwhelm censorship, making the Internet innately democratic. However, capitalism tamed the Internet and its countercultural tendencies in a short time. The web's champions didn't recognize the limits of their clash with hierarchical capitalist powers. Consider how the Internet evolved from its earliest creation. The technological base of the Internet sprang from subsidized research, some from before World War II. More than one-third of its university researchers received money from national security agencies. The Internet gets only limited direct support, but if you include tax breaks and subsidies for wireless access, the U.S. government spent ten times more on the Internet than on the Manhattan Project. The early Internet was considered non-commercial, even anti-commercial. When the first commercial email message appeared, people criticized the sender. The 1990s brought a fundamental change. People sought to monetize the web, transforming a public service into a capitalist sector. No single legislative decision or policy forced the change and few people recognized the transformation as it occurred. Click the link below for more information.